Hello, I'm Xiaobo Zai, the first author of Effectiveness of Clinical Pharmacists in Reducing Mortality in Hospitalized Cardiac Patients, a Propensity Score Matched Analysis. I am a clinical pharmacist of Shanghai East Hospital and have more than 20 years of clinical experience. I might be regarded as a clinical pharmacist in China that can make life-saving pharmacy interventions. Pharmacist-led uh, medical review services have been assessed in the meta-analysis in hospital. And length of, of hospital stay and hospitalization expenses could be reduced, and so the adverse drug events. However, the mortality can't be decreases. We assume that the main reason was that the inter investigators had not conducted research on cases of death specifically and had not identified all possible drug-related problems that could cause or contribute to mortality and then convinced physicians correct. So we carried out a clinical trial for more than five years in our hospital's cardiology. Pharmacists were consulted by the physicians to correct any drug-related issues that they suspected may cause or contribute to a fatal outcome. A total of 1,541 interventions were suggested by the clinical pharmacists in the study group, and 1,413 of them were accepted by the cardiology team. All cause mortality was 1.5% uh, during pre intervention and was reduced to 0.9% during post intervention, and the, the difference was statistically significant. After propensity score matching, all cause mortality changed from 1.7% during pre intervention down to 1.0% during post intervention, and the difference was also statistically significant. All cause mortality is a hard indica indicator, and reduced mortality can fully reflect the value of clinical pharmacists and improve the status of them greatly. In order to make the results more convincing, the randomized multi-center double-blinded studies should be reduced in the future. Thank you.